Tuesday night's regional semifinal game against Libertyville. The Giants used a stout defensive effort and 30 points from David Sachs to beat the Wildcats 60 to 50. Sachs opened up the game with back-to-back -back three pointers and he himself outscored Libertyville halfway through the first quarter. His domination continued for the rest of the half as he scored 18 of the team's 28 points but the Giants held just a four-point halftime lead on the Wildcats. Both Sachs and coach Paul Harris credited the point guard's electrifying first half to the team's ability to find Sachs for open looks early in the game. First play, Coach Randall, I hit a shot. And you know, my team and my teammates had great confidence in me to get those shots and hit them, so they kept finding me. They made the right pass, made the right play, and they found me to get those shots. We've been talking to David about being assertive offensively, <laughs> and he just, uh, really came out, hit a couple shots early, I think got his confidence going. Libertyville missed their first six shots of the second half and the Giants took advantage, establishing a 10 point lead. However, the Wildcats started the fourth quarter on a run to cut the Highland Park lead to just four. But Sachs took over the game once again to stop the bleeding. And in the final three minutes, the Giants shot 19 free throws to put the game on ice and win 60 to 50. After the game, Sachs spoke about some of the keys to the Giants stopping Libertyville's run to start the fourth quarter. We needed to rebound in order to get those stops and get to the free throw line when we were in bonus, and Krylitz and Hallberg came up huge with some big boards. The Giants held Libertyville star center Joe Borsha to just seven points. Jordan Krawitz commented on some of the ways in which the Giants kept him quiet. He's a great player, just when his touches and make him shoot the ball, and I think we did a good job with that. The Giants will face off against Lake Forest in tonight's regional championship game at Libertyville High School. The two teams last played in December when Lake Forest eked out a 48-45 win in overtime. But the Giants are ready to have another go at the scouts. We're going to try to go to the weight room in the next two days, get a little stronger. Uh, Lake Forest is a great team, and uh, we're just happy to be playing. So we're really excited for the uh, chance to play in a regional final. Play hard, have fun, regional championship. Let's try to get the W. In Libertyville, Sam Brief, HBTV.